afternoon again. This is Eric Northwest Bus Sales. Thank you for your time. Once again, uh, what we got here is, well, I know you've probably been seeing a few of these online. That's because we got a few of them in stock right now. We've got a number of these Thomas commercial style buses right here in stock. Some flat nose, some conventional cabs, some 44 passenger, some 28 passenger, short short ones, long ones. I'll tell you what, these Degum uh, commercial style buses that we get in, they don't stick around too long, so here we go. This one's a 44 passenger, 2003 Thomas commercial bus, activity bus. I've heard people call them that before, multi-function school activity bus military bus whatever the heck you want to call it well that's what we got but thomas calls it a safety liner so thomas safety liner 2003 dual entry grab bars as you come in step well treads showing pretty good also looking pretty good front engine let's pop open the doghouse right here and get a look see what we got oh yeah one of my faves 5.9 liter Cummins. You can't go wrong with that, although I am a little bit biased. So, here's the driver's seat. Full stream not in too bad a shape. Showing, showing some wear, some sun fading over here. A little bit of wear here up front, but not too bad. She's got a ton of service left in her. Look at the miles, 128,000 miles. Lots of life, lots of life left on that 5.9 Cummins. Mm. For those of you that aren't familiar with Cummins, 5.9 liter turbo diesel inline six cylinder Cummins diesel. Can't go wrong with that. Control panel over here, courtesy lighting for the passenger and the driver and what have you. Power and heated mirrors right there. Ooh, little 12 volt charger. Air horn, check it. Ha, <laughs> yeah. There's even one here on the steering wheel. There we go. Here's your AC controls right down here driver and passenger heat and AC high idle control Ooh, there we go kick that idle up a little bit Allison automatic five-speed transmission it's the MD 3060 five-speed automatic all right let's check her out oh AM FM CD player up top there interior convex mirror nice little sunshade here for the driver with the sliding window as well dual armrest for the air ride driver's seat I failed to mention check out these coach style seats kind of high back bucket captain's chairs if you will here for the passenger seats now I know we're showing a little bit of use right here well okay that's a fair amount of use look at that mm-hmm in these high traffic areas I'm not gonna lie she's got a little bit of use on the upholstery but also let me tell you that I've got new seat covers on order a couple weeks out yet I just didn't want to hesitate to get this baby online because these are hot, hot buses and they don't last. So, don't get discouraged by the seat. There's only like six or eight of them that are showing that much use. The rest of them are in pretty daggum good shape. So, anyhow, like I said, we're getting those fixed. Rear emergency door, ducted AC going down both sides. Check it. Mm-hmm. Big tour style, tour style windows with tint. It's got kind of a school bus feel to it, but these windows say otherwise. I'll tell you what, I like it. I like it a lot. Footrest, check it out. Oh yeah, footrest on the backs of these also. This is work primo for like a school bus, uh, you know, private school bus, something like that. Work good for a sports department, athletic department, hauling football teams and whatnot, getting, getting around for that. So crew hauler, employee transport, that type of application work wonderfully for that all right enough about the interior here let's walk around her outside let's check out the tire tread i like that look here we go easy from tire tread there's the mill coming front engine comes right there this baby's got a pile of tire tread look at that looks good looks real good all right Body and paint's in pretty good, gum good shape here. We do have a small under storage compartment right there. We'll accommodate some gear as well. Look at that. Maybe I'll open that up for you. Let's check it out. 
I gotta say, I think this thing's got new paint on it. You know what, it does. New exterior paint, look at that, there we go. Nice little storage area. Peaks around the corner there a little bit, a couple feet. So, fair amount of storage area. Just like that. All right, oh, doggone it. There we go. All right, check out the tire tread here on the rear duels. Got a nice set of mud and snows on there, it looks like, all terrain. Get a look at the undercarriage here a little bit. Just on that, as you can tell, it's quite clean. Yep, very nice. Body and paint looks primo on this thing. Fuel door right here. Let's check out the fuel. Oh, shoot. You know what? I always get these confused with a Bluebird. Bluebird always puts a little sticker in here on the fuel capacity. So, but this is a Thomas. So, anyhow, I'm going to kind of shoot in the dark right there a little bit. I think it's probably a 55, 65 gallon tank. Don't hold me to it, though. You can see the midship lights there up top, clearance lights, ambers up front, red in the rear, LED clearance lights, LED brake lights, turn signals, tail lights and backup lights. It looks like the backup lights are incandescent bulbs. Let's check out the rear emergency door. Love the buzzer. Oh my goodness. That'll drive a man nuts. I'll tell you what, I can't listen to that too terribly much longer. We are showing a little bit of corrosion right here on the back, so heads up about that. But, so let's take a look at the undercarriage here from Look at that. It looks pretty clean underneath though. Real clean. You can see the AC condenser and fans over there on your left. Look at that rear end. I'll tell you what, I think that's a Dana. I believe Dana is the manufacturer of these rear ends and these big boys. So, a couple tow hooks right here. I'll tell you what, this one will get it done. Get the job done and a whole lot more. So, like I said, new exterior paint sweet looking bus you know what i i you know i i've said twice now i think this has new exterior paint and i gotta say i don't think it does now i'm looking over here we got some dings and scratches and what have you around the fender well here so there i i don't i don't believe we had it painted but there's been evidence that someone previous previous operators probably did some touch up on the other side there which is why it looks so good so anyhow don't want to mislead you just trying to shoot you straight there we go, good tread there on the driver's side as well. Driver's side rear duels. Open up the battery box right here. Got a couple, three batteries in here on a slide out tray. Oh yeah. And look at that, driver's side front. A lot of tread there. Look at that tread deck. All right, J box right here. Woo! A lot of, well, man, we got a lot going on right in there, I'll tell you what. All right, power and heated mirrors, crossover mirrors as well. LED amber clearance lights up front. Thomas Safety Liner 2003. Once again, thank you for your time. Check us out online, nwbus.com. Please call any questions, 800-231-7099. Thanks.